Hogwarts. Okay, um, my niece Caitlin is streaming right now, and I forgot to hit go on the video. No, it's not. <laughs> I didn't even write. Cleveland Cavaliers. Okay. World of Colors. Anyway, we're playing Jeopardy. In Dutch Bruin. Uh, I'm gonna say brown. Yes, correct. Brown was calling to me. Songs you can see. Look at the following image. Bananarama and the shocking blue both went to number one by going to outer space with this song. And Venus? Yes. It almost shows Neptune. It was Venus. 1984. Apple introduced this influential computer model on January 24th. Uh, Macintosh. That's right. The How am I glitching? The Spirit of St. Louis. This type of transport on... St. Louis's official seal symbolizes the city's early growth. Steamboat, covered wagon, or locomotive? That's not correct. That's her Wi-Fi. It's a locomotive. No, it's a steamboat. <laughs> the one I didn't want to choose. Well, I'm not on Wi-Fi, so it can't be mine. Wow, that was an astonishing performance. Either that or they don't realize that my brain's not exactly connected to my mouth sometimes. <laughs> um. No, that's not what I wanted. Ah, return to main menu. Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Return to main menu. Okay, so how long is this? Oh, gosh. Okay. So we're going to play Jeopardy. We're going to do family mode. Introducing our contestants. Me. Patricia. Oh, no. Robert. To begin the first round, we have Kitty Lit. Okay. Creatures of the Night. Elements. Elements. Good Sports. Good Sports. Oh, yeah. Okay. Who gets to go first? Player three. Pick of a category. Course. Mike Trout and Clayton Kershaw play this professional sport. I want to say hockey. Sadly, that's not it. Okay, my next guess is baseball. Correct. Dang it. Player two, which category would you like? The team sport known to U.S. fans as soccer is called this by most of the world. That'd be football. And what we call football is called rugby. That's it. Player one, it's your turn to choose a category. Olympians, Gabriel... Douglas, Simone Biles, and Ali Raisman took 2016 gold as part of the U.S. team in this sport. I want to say gymnastics. That's correct. Yes. <laughs> Player two. Um, let's go with something I'm scared of. The, the coins seen here are made 
of 75% copper and 25% this metal. Silver. Okay, we'll go with, uh... That's not it. Yes. Nickel. <laughs> Player three, which category would you like? Hey, I got that. Okay, released in 2016, Del... Down is the 11th book in Jeff Kinney's series Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Yes, correct. Player one, it's your turn to choose a category. In an Eric Carl, I may have said that wrong, classic, The Very Hungry. This animal eat caterpillar eats watermelon sausage pie, a cupcake, and gets a tummy ache. Come on. That's right. It's a very hungry caterpillar. And he also eats through a lollipop. And where the wild things are, he wears his wolf suit, makes mischief, and is sent to bed without a supper. I think his name's Max. Yes, yes his name is Max. I've never read that one. It's a daily oh, no. dollar. How much do you want to wager? Look at the following image. E equals MC squared. The man whose equation is seen here had this element named for him. Einstein? Exactly. Einsteinium. Okay. Observe the following image. In the science scene here, a current is passing through a tube filled with this noble gas. I don't know. Uh, xenon? Neon. Yes. Okay, neon, neon, neon. Player two, pick a category. If you've seen a flying one of these, it might be because they're nocturnal. Oh, if you've never seen one. Uh, Bullwinkle's pal is an exception. Squirrel. You are right. Player one, it's your turn to choose a category. Creatures of the night. Um, because tadpoles are four times bigger than adults, the nocturnal Pseudus Paradoxa is known as the shrinking this. Lizard, frog, or salamander? Yes. Frog. Last clue. The tip. Pity, whatever that says, or Brazilian this is a nocturnal member of the genus Silva, Silvagus or Cottontail. Rabbit. Dang it, he got it. You got right. it. At the end of the Jeopardy round, here are the placements. For the Double Jeopardy round, the categories are Young People in History Snack Attack Snack Attack? Get a job already Classic Disney Title Characters <gasps> Classic Disney Title Characters! I can do that one
Nacho cheese and Cool Ranch are two flavors of this Frito Lay brand of tortilla chips. Doritos. Well done. Player one, which category would you like? Look at the following image. A cuter version of the animal seen here is in I mean, is the conscience of this character. Uh, cricket. So it makes it look like you're trying to name it a cricket, and then all of a sudden it. Observe the following image. The dish seen here provides a key romantic moment for these two characters. If it asks Lady and the Tramp, I'm gonna be mad. Yep, Lady and the Tramp. Hey, no, I got sorry. it first. I know, my Disney, Lady and the Tramp. Look at the following image. An object like the one seen here gives the evil queen unwelcome news about this title character. The title character is Snow White, and that's Mirror. So what's the answer going to be? Well done. Snow White. Um, let's get the rude one over with. This occupation consists of perm perambulating with passengers and snowsers. Dog walking. That's not it. It is babysitting. Precisely. Of course you have to know what a snowser is. <laughs> yeah, right. How much money are you wagering? You can charge the neighbors a few bucks simply to do this or a triple if you add detailing, light waxing, and armor awling. Uh, wash the car. Kids can turn yellow into green by selling this drink made by Country Time. Lemonade? That's correct. Lemonade. <laughs> Yoplay makes this portable yogurt in a tube a perfect snack when you're on the move. Go, Gert! You What's up, correct. Sam? A fluffer nutter is a sandwich of peanut butter and cream named for this confection. I don't know. No, it's not. Oh good, I was gonna answer that. Precisely. Marshmallow. <laughs> My answer was marshmallow. In 338 BC, at age 18, he commanded the cavalry in his father's army in the Battle of Charonia. I don't know. In Macedonia. I'm guessing Alexander. Exactly. All right. 
playing to, please select a category. On July 15th, 1944, she entered into her diary, I can feel the suffering of millions. I'm going to guess Anne Frank. Because Laura was before that. That's My it. cat's got the zoomies. Here's the last clue. It's a daily double. Oh, a daily double. How much do you want to wager? He restored Thebes as cap as capital of ancient Egypt, but is probably better known for being discovered in 1922. Uh, too uncommon. Precisely. Okay. <laughs> the two contestants who will be playing Final Jeopardy are me and Patricia. How much money are you wagering? Uh, the 200. It's the largest country in the world without any permanent natural rivers or lakes. I'm going to say Saudi Arabia. Oh. I was just guessing. <laughs> That's right. You know, I was guessing because they've got more sand Here are the and desert places. than we do. <laughs> Our champion today is me. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you are, I hope you're having a good day. Know that you are enough. Know that there's no problem you cannot solve or handle. Please buy my books and I'll see you in the next video.